Hi guys, welcome to this week's vlogs. It will include me, my husband, and Kiara, and things that we do, we have done throughout the week. I will be doing these weekly, uh, posting on Sunday nights. Video. Oh. She is trying to crawl over here. She's lifting her head high. Oh. Yeah. And she uses her knees to try to lift herself up by crawling. And you see I shake this and she can she looks at it. Yeah. And this is another toy that she loves to play with. It's just a whole bunch of different things she can grab onto. Um, these things you can bring across. So she gets a hold of that and she likes it. This is just like, uh, she holds it like this pretty much. And she just shakes it, lifts it up, holds it. She's getting better at holding things lately. So that's good. And then she has this mirror here. And you can just see if she can see herself in it. And then she likes this here, how it crunches. And makes the bow noise. And then over here we have this dragon here and it makes crunchy noises. And we have a car which makes two different sounds. That sound, that is kind of dying at the moment. And then we have a fun sound. And this just goes back and forth. Like so. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> That's too much. I just assist her with this arm. Here we go. trying to pull off her socks. Yeah, she loves to pull off her socks. Look at that cute little Yeah. My hiccups. Mm-hmm. Yeah, hiccups, girl. Yeah. Isn't she just the cutest thing ever? Oh, I love her. Okay, so it's evening now and we're going out for a walk with Kiara. Uh, it's starting to become the fall season and it's getting a little colder outside so we got her on to a little sweater she loves chewing on her sleeve this sweater's fitting pretty good yeah she's all that happy so the neighborhood's pretty good a lot of green trees they're thinking of building a basketball court they're almost finished over there and over here we don't even know what these are but we call them the Teletubby poles 
If you have any idea what they are, please leave a comment in the section below because we'd love to know what they are. Have anything to add to that? Wonderful woman of my life. Yeah, you just enjoying yourself? Yeah, I'm just enjoying this beautiful summer day with my husband and Kiara and having some water refreshments. It's always good. <laughs> it looks more like booster juice to me. Well, it's in a booster juice cup, but it's still water. Uh huh. Lucky you, lucky you. So here I'm making pasta with homemade pasta sauce. This is just my um, remaining dishes and remaining pasta. So I just have the pasta in there, and this is where I cook my sauce in this pan. That's just the leftovers. And this is what I'm eating right here. So it just has chicken in there, pasta, and noodles in the pasta sauce. It has um, tomatoes, garlic, onion, and different kinds of spices. I had pepper in there. I had dillweed in there. I had um, tarragon in there. Focus. I'm not gonna focus. And I had basil in there. And so this is how I make my yogurt. Okay. Yogurt here is what I use. I pour about the bottom of the bowl. So, as you can see, I have about that much in there. And then the third ingredient is my half hearts. I grab a tablespoon, fill that up once, put it in. Is my chia. Grab one tablespoon. And then I have my black seeds, which I like to put in a seal container here. Sometimes I'll add fruit, as in strawberries, blueberries, or raspberries. So that's what I put in that. And the finished look, I'll show you the finished look here. Looks like this. So that is what it looks like. And then I just mix it up. Or sometimes I'll add berries, like um, dried fruit berries. Um, but yeah, that's what it looks like. I'm just so yummy with the crumble. See, I need to add more crumble because you can barely see it. But yeah, that's what I eat for my yogurt. It's, it varies differently, but these are the ingredients I mostly put in. So we got the chia, the flax, the hemp, my yogurt, which I buy from Costco. Give you a better look on that. So I buy this creamy vanilla too. Kilogram and it's good in a seal and the brand is Eggo. Sorry, it's like really full. <laughs> there we go. That's what it looks like. Kitchen volume is pretty good. And I like how it just comes in like this and you just pour it. So it's a big jug. Yeah. You can make smoothies with it, you can do anything really. But yeah, it's pretty good. Fits well in the refrigerator as well. Hi guys, I just finished my workout. I did a five minute warm up and then I did my workout finishing with a cool down and this protein powder. Hour and have some lunch. I'm gonna have some chili, so that should be good. 
Um, yeah. We're out for a Saturday night stroll on this path here. And this is what the path looks back there. Ooh, and we're here camera waving. And are here with Kiara and Richard. Again. Hello. You get to see me this time. <laughs> Kiara, do you have anything to say? No, you just don't want to look at the camera? Okay. <laughs> food trucks here at Cayman's. We have the Cocoville food truck, the gastro, the donuts. And we have over here the Biffa Boys and Smokestack. Solid humans on top. And uh, yeah, we enjoyed ourselves. This is located in Ontario. This is the grilled cheese from the Gouda food truck and it has meat, spinach, mozzarella cheese and it comes with these chips, chips. here. Delicious. Balsamic vinegar. Oh and balsamic vinegar is in there as well for the sauce. The next the Cocoville food truck. We're having the nacho supreme. It has nacho cheese, seasoned ground beef, lettuce, tomato, cream cheese, salsa, and corn chips. garden area. If we put the stroller up here, he managed to put it up here. Oh yeah, First I'm still working on ever. it. Still working on it. As he goes up these steps, it gets easier. It gets easier. <laughs> I'm gonna introduce you to my mom here. Hi. <laughs> I see a goldfish in there. Yeah, lots of fishes around. Well it's definitely a roller coaster for her. I know, right? She's been on lots of roller coasters lately with the stroller. Yeah, try to keep cart. the camera still. It is still. No, you're dragging it all over the place. Yeah, it's got that. <laughs> yeah, this is the view. And this is their field where they grow all their strawberries. And this is a pond area up here. And a windmill. You can see pretty flowers. Oh, struggles real with these stairs. Can I have fun getting down? <laughs> this is a waterfall. There's a frog in here. I don't know. How nice roller coaster ride. Gorgeous. Be easier. Oh yeah. <laughs> Little stairs. Less oh. bumpy though. Do we go left or right? A few. Oh, uh. I see these flowers over here. Oh yeah. I think they do look like the kind that is. summertime though when it's warmer season not so much mosquitoes and bugs everywhere yes. a little swamp right there of course. Other than that, it's nice to look at oh, say hi to you. she's looking at the plants I know. <laughs> she likes their surroundings right, let's go for the bumpy ride and cherries with lots of bees <laughs> different kind of flowers all if around if there were more of those i'd throw them at you <laughs> that's so nice Little spiky balls. Oh. That's another thing they have. Nice white flowers. Mm -hmm. Butterflies going around. Very nice flowers. Flower bush 
here. Oh wow, look at these big flowers over here. This is the green roses.